So I thought there was going to be um, enough line of sight, but these trees are getting in the way, so I'm going to measure it down here using my Leica Mini Prism. And just let's find the target which I've got. Lock the target. I've got this Leica Mini Prism here. Let's see. Target lock lock. Oops. Lock the target. And uh, I can read right on the mark here. So I get the bubble level. I've got to put the number in. This is point number 24. Get the bubble nice and level on the prism, like so. You can see that. Target not And now I'm going to go over to these two marks over here, which I found as well. I think that we'll see these okay with a Leica Mini Prism. Maybe not. Because there's some marked, uh, some builders um, fencing in the way. All the things we've got to do is survey. It's always chopping and changing our prisms and heights of prism and types of prism to get the shot. Go back to my prism pole with a Leica 360 degree prism and carbon fibre pole. Find the number for this one. I like to write it down on a piece of paper so I can see what I'm doing. A lot of people like just to use a controller for everything but I still like to have a bit of paper with the numbers written on it. This is going to be point number 22, 22 and 23. We'll go 22 and 22. I'll do that one. 22, 1.52 high. Find the target. Lock the target. I'll do twenty-three. Just as I do this, some people arrive to pick up the fencing. How convenient was that? To worry. I'll use the taller pile. Can I just quickly yeah. measure that? Just, just. You want to move this? Oh, I'm just looking up the up the road behind you, behind oh, your legs. Yeah. Yep, thanks. Won't be a sec. Yeah. Right. What's that? Lock the target. 
Am I gonna use it? Fucking plant this little bat. What is that a bat? I'm not gonna think of that. We'll put the blocks on off the front. Clock, clock, clock.